Influence, I think it really lends itself well to, uh, to, to understanding where the DJ comes forth uh, and that part of performance is, uh, is making it a little bit more dynamic with some scratching and some cutting, that kind of thing. I'm your captain, take you on a trip to an inner cellar experience. Trip you in tight, gonna be a long ride. Have your ticket out when I come by, I won't go too fast. So enjoy the view. Well, my first live music experience was when I was five. I studied classical violin and I'm still a professional violinist. And I was forced to play at Roy Thompson Hall, which is the largest performing um, hall in Toronto. And I was scared out of my mind. But from that moment, that fear and that excitement became my drug and my passion. I think mine was a piano recital, and I think I pissed my pants. <laughs> so I, I participated in a lot of organizations, a lot of shows that promote giving people skills. Um, there's a lot of organizations in Toronto that promote um, job training for the homeless. Rather than giving them a shelter, you're giving them training so that they don't need a shelter. And you're not telling them to get a job, and you're giving them the training so that they can have a sustainable one thing that I can always go out and do that I always feel great about is, uh, is any sort of benefit. But it's always in Hip Hop for Hunger is a big thing in, in Canada. Just uh, Hip Hop for Hunger is just basically, uh, I mean, hip hop is com as a community based thing. And I mean, it, it, it's, it's just about getting artists together to raise awareness. If you have community, then you care about the people at the top and the bottom, whoever you're in your community. You gotta make time for me. You know I'm worth the wait making no mistakes You gotta do right by me Baby, what can I do To keep this thing new I don't wanna lose you Baby, it's making time 